Hello there, adventurers. Ben. Danielle. You're watching the Malik, Malik Adventures. Adventures. And I don't know what I'm doing with my hands today. And on today's episode, we're unboxing the April version of... Disney Store. Hall. And as always, there's no common theme. But first, make sure you guys like the video. Subscribe. Comment down below. Hit that bell while you're down there as well. Uh, so you get notifications for whenever we post. Every Tuesday and Thursday at 12. Boom. Oh, yeah. Sneak that in. Yeah, I know, right? It was a little sweet. But first. Rah! been uh, scouring well when I say we I mean Danielle has been scouring the deep recesses of the Disney store that makes it even so much better with the eyes <laughs> like that was amazing to find great items that we would love on the Disney store and I think you have hit the jackpot on this one Danielle and it's probably like one of the most expensive hauls that we're gonna be doing yep Pretty much. Mainly because there's a couple Star Wars things in here. Galaxy's Edge stuff in mm -hmm. here. And I'll tell you right now, no, there is no uh, lightsabers. There's no legacy sword or legacy um, blades in there. So, what could be so expensive? It's the socks. <laughs> it's the socks. It's super expensive socks. <laughs> no, but we do have some Haunted Mansion socks here. So, that's the front. No, that's the back. Just kidding. This is the front. And then the back does say, Ghost, I will. A ghost will follow, follow you, you home. home. I don't have my glasses on. Sorry. And here is the most expensive item. Okay, maybe not the most expensive <laughs> item, but probably the cutest item in this haul. It is a figment of your imagination. And if you don't know who figment is, you haven't spent enough time at Epcot. <laughs> or you spend too much time drinking the, uh, we're not going down that road. Um, then yeah, who's Epcot? Because I didn't know who he who's was. Who's Epcot? <laughs> <laughs> who is Figment? Because so, I didn't really know him until we went to really Epcot. <laughs> so Figment is actually the mascot for Epcot. So any like themes that they have throughout the year, like um, food and wine or festival of the arts, there's always Figment doing something. And there's actually a ride that is Figment of your imagination. <laughs> okay, so let's move on to items that we actually have two of. Ready? Ready? Well. <laughs> Scream canisters. They're actually water bottles, but they look like scream canisters and they <laughs> sound like scream canisters from Monsters Inc. And this is something we looked at a few months ago and it went out of stock online. Mm -hmm. And so we had to wait and wait. And then finally back in January, yeah, I know this is how we hoard things. Back in January, we finally actually got them. Um. And so what you do is you push the button and you unlock it. The only sad thing is these look huge, right? They only hold though about um. I think it what, said twenty ounces. They don't no, hold I very think much. It said sixteen. Yeah, it's not very big on the inside. But it's pretty cool. Yeah. looking so Definitely. we're just gonna have these to impress our friends conversational starter or you know you take the straw out and now it's actually a screen it's canister. actually really cool like that when you have whatever you have there yeah. liquid that is and pretty you cool you can decrease it okay uh, uh here's the most expensive item it's an no. astromech personality chip well yes it's it's not Danielle, do you know what a personal or astromech personality chip is? Yes, I bought it, so I should know. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like to tell the friends at home that don't know what it is or might not know what it is? So if I think this doesn't work with 
Does it, is that only um, R2-D2? No, it, it, okay, first of all, it's a chip that goes into a droid from Galaxy's Edge. Um, and I think they only work with droids from the Droid Depot. Okay. Uh, the custom ones that you make for $100. Which we did make one, so yeah. uh, um, check out our video. Check that video down. That's actually our number two, two video on our channel, so check out the card somewhere here that I put into the video. And then maybe Ben will insert the personality, how it actually works. Yeah, maybe I'll, I'll drop a little clip in right here in three, two, one. So I hope you enjoyed that little clip. And fun thing is it changes their voice. There's three different types. There's a um, like a rebel, imperial, and then I think a first order. But I can't remember. I don't know. I just picked one. But we didn't buy one when, uh, when we, we were, were there. there. Because we were like, I don't want to spend another, I just spent $100. I don't want to spend another 15 And it was crowded. That too. And it was hard to hear them. Here is the expensive item. <laughs> the box. Just kidding. And what is it, Ben? This is... Well, it's a robot. No. It's a droid. Um, it's an in... Ooh, ooh! It is DJ Rex. So if you've ever gone to the cantina in Galaxy's Edge, uh, DJ Rex is the character that uh, basically is the DJ there that plays all the music. But reading the back here, he has light-up eyes, a retractable neck, Remote controlled body, blue. He has a Bluetooth speaker in him, y'all. You can connect him to some music from your phone via Bluetooth. He's got some DJ sound effects, mix and match, articulating arms. This dude was expensive. Funny story behind it, too. Danielle was like, Ben, do you want me to get this for you for your Star Wars corner? And I said, no, no, it's okay. He, he's expensive, he's big, he takes up a lot of room. And then Disney Store came and the Disney box. Disney Store box. Or sorry, a yeah, Disney Store box came. And, uh, and then you're like, can I open this? And well, <laughs> well, I said, can I open this box? And you said, yeah, sure. And I go, what'd you get from Disney Store? And you're like, stop opening the box! I don't think this was a, was this a surprise in it? No. No, there's something else in it that I don't, it's coming in a different video. Maybe. But, definitely. And so I said, hey, guess what? What I got. <laughs> and so what we'll do is, uh, just like we did with the personality chip, we'll insert another video here to just check out some of the cool features of DJ Rex coming up in at you in three, in two, in one, and... Pretty, pretty awesome stuff there. I think I've had too much time, fun playing with him. I wonder if he interacts with the droids. Ooh. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, I don't know. That'd be a good question to ask. Or to try. Yeah. We'll see. Who knows, maybe it makes it into the video. We'll, we'll figure that out. Okay, so ben, but, what's your favorite item? Well, is that a silly question? What do you think my this favorite one? item? No, it's segment. Oh. <laughs> no, it, it, it is DJ Rex. That's pretty darn cool. Oh, now you think it's pretty cool? Oh, you've already bought it. What am I going to say? <laughs> no, this is terrible. Of course I'm um, going to think it's cool. You like, like the scream this. canisters? Yes. Yeah. So, what is your guys' favorite uh, item from this? We're going to call this an expensive haul. Disney Store <laughs> April Expensive Haul. Yes. I like that title. Thanks for helping me figure that one out, Danielle. <laughs> but anyways, what? drop a comment down below. What was your favorite item? Would you be willing to pull the trigger on this DJ Rex? Um, I don't think very many people would. You have to be a hardcore Star Wars fan or a wife that doesn't listen. <laughs> but until next time, friends, make sure you stay safe. 
stay magical. And keep adventuring, and we'll see you on the next adventure. Bye. Bye.